good morning. Woo, it's just a little windy. I was gonna say, new hair, what do you think? But not like you can tell, right? Holy cow, I may have to go sit in a quiet little area here. It is 62 degrees, a little chilly, a little bit windy, but anyway, good morning, Mike. Oh my goodness, wow, very windy. Um, like I said, 62 degrees. I just looked at my, good morning, Susan. I just looked at the, uh, what do I want to say, my weather app to see what it was right now. And I just saw the bad four letter word for next Monday. What the heck is that about? Oh yeah, it's October, isn't it? Thank you, Rebecca. I love the new hair. Not like you guys can tell right now, because oh, hold on, I'll turn around and maybe, maybe we'll go this way and you'll be able to tell a little bit better, but it's kind of fun and funky. It's, it's definitely much, much, much darker. Um, it's very dark today. We'll see, uh, you know, obviously it's gonna lighten up. Um, we had to put a ton of dark in it because it was so blonde, but you know, it's just kind of choppy and I'm trying really hard, you guys that know me, I'm trying really hard to do the messy. Um, I'm such a, a recovering perfectionist. That's a, big, that's a big thing for me right now. I'm working very hard on not being a perfectionist anymore and learning all the things that that perfectionism has been hurting me um, in the way I've raised my kids and everything else my entire life. But so anyway, this is the hair today. What do you think? But yeah, perfect is not gonna happen, is it? Especially when you live in Wyoming with this wind. How fun is this? But yeah, I love it. I love the, um, here we're in the, we're in the shade a little bit better. You can see it. So yeah, I absolutely love it. My hair lady is the bomb. I took a picture to her and said, this is what I want. And I'm telling you, you guys have seen the picture. She did a very good job. Now, I, my bangs, because a couple times ago, I don't even know when it was, at one point we decided that, you know, maybe I'd look good in bangs. So we did bangs, so now they're growing out. So the picture, thank you so much, Suzanne. I think it's fun. I think, I think short is sassy. I don't know why I've had, I do love playing with my hair. Um, I actually have been pretty boring this past summer. I, sorry, I had an itch. Um, I kind of kept my hair the same, like all summer long. I was so worked up on that anniversary that I had coming up, big anniversary party. I didn't want to do this and then hate it and then be super sad that, oh, there's the sun behind us, you know, and then be super sad that um, I was going to this anniversary party and looking horrible. But uh, of course now, because I do love it, I wish I had just done it. But yeah, we'll have to deal with the growth of the bangs because I want them, you know, more the same length here. like. And then it'll be funner to, you know, I think whip it. But um, yeah, Ed, I think I think short is is fun and sassy. But um, oh, Suzanne, you know Angie. Yeah, Angie is the best. I've had, I have been so fortunate. I have to say, in my hair ladies, holy moly, I've had some good hair ladies. And I usually am. Oh, sorry. Like I can't even figure out how to get you guys. There you go. Um, I stick with them until something happens and like they either leave. So I had Kristen goats for years um, until she quit it because she was gonna raise her little babies. And now of course she's in the valley. Love, love, love Kristen. Um, I really don't think when I had the super short hair, anybody cut it as good as Kristen did. And I think from Kristen, I don't know, I think I've tried a couple, but then I got with um, Alicia Ruback, who was killer. She was an amazing hairstylist um, until she decided to quit doing hair because they opened up the fishbowl and then she became the, um, what's it called you guys, uh, bartender. And she was the bartender and I think now she's even working in the kitchen, but, um, and then I found Angie. So I've had some amazing, there are so many amazing hairstylists out there locally. I know we have so, so many. I have so many friends who do hair that I, I would be, you know, just happy going to them, but, um, but anyway, yeah, so this was all done by Angie last night. She's amazing. So anyway, fun, right? So let's talk serious. It's October. We killed the special last night. So if you were on yesterday and you knew anything about the special um, and you didn't get your hands on any by chance, I did get a couple of extra. So um, if you did miss that, let me know. Um, let's see what else. So the live had its it's hitches. Uh, I was, I had about five people who were trying to get on and we were on and we were off, but it all worked out. None of 
myself nor any of my friends and my customers or whatever lot, uh, won the, I mean, they gave away big stuff last night. They gave away a month's worth of BioCell. They gave away a whole new system. Okay, it's a little chilly. I'm gonna go sit down. Um, they gave away, oh, the, the uh, skincare. So the only thing left is, um, thank you, uh, uh, Lori and mom. Yeah, I love the hair and Angie is fantastic. Um, the only thing left is today they're going to be going back through all the comments that were left last night and one more person is going to win the entire skincare line. I'm so hoping it's me. Um, I commented all kinds last night on it hoping to get, you know, hoping to win. But so we still have one more winner to be announced. But other than that, thank you guys. It was a huge success. We of course crashed the system. We sold out of the special. Sorry, I gotta look down. I'm going down some crazy steep steps. I'm trying to find a spot over here out of the wind a little bit. It's kind of, oh, it's, it's chilly. All right, let's sit. So anyway, we, we sold out the special. We, we killed it. Anyway, so that's all done. Um, don't forget, I'm doing the chemo care packs. So, so far I've got um, uh, almost five sponsored. Uh, you can donate any amount of money. If 25 is too much, that is how much I'm asking per chemo care pack. Um, I am gonna do the difference. I think currently, oh, this is crazy. The, it's, it's becoming, it's definitely fall in Wyoming, isn't it? Um, so anyway, the chemo care packs, they actually cost uh, closer to, I think it's a little more than 27, you know, and then plus if you were going to do the orders, plus the shipping um, and the bags, I'm going to cover all that and I will probably do um, at least two uh, chemo care packs myself. But if you are interested in donating any and sponsoring any, that'd be great. If you don't want to do the full cost, <laughs> this is going to be annoying, isn't it? And I can't get my, my phone to stay up. If you don't want to do the full cost of the 25, like yesterday I got somebody who gave me 20. Um, and we'll just see how the money works out if, uh, you know, and then if someone does more or less, we'll just add it all to it. But then if whatever it comes up to at the end, I'm going to cover the, the rest of it. Um, I'm getting a contact with our local hospital uh, to talk to them about donating them to, we have a new um, cancer unit here. Um, it's not brand new, but it's, it, I, I believe it's new since last year. Thank you, mom. I'll put you down for one. So now we're up to six, you guys. Um, I can't wait to see how many we can do. I wanted to be aggressive and say, you know, 25 uh, that we could do. And then I'm like, well, you know, maybe I don't want to make it too big and, and upset myself. So I'll, we'll say we're going to do 10. But here we are on day, oh, what is it? Um, is today the third? I've been wrapped up in payroll. I don't even know what the day is, but I think it's the third and we've got six sponsored already. So um, we can do this, you guys. Let's do 25 candy. Thank you for the message. I I love your long blonde hair, but I really love this, the, the short dark that you have as well. So um, I just think it's fun. And it's definitely, I love changing up my hair. Um, normally I go every six weeks and my hair lady knows usually it's something different. And like I said, this whole summer, I kind of was just letting it grow long and blonde and you know, with all of our liquid collagen. I mean, it just grows and grows and grows. So I've got all kinds of new growth. She can't get over how thick it is. And so we just, you know, it's fun to cut it. In a few weeks, it's gonna be down to here anyway. So no, you know, no worries if I didn't like it. But anyway, so if you're interested in a can cancer chemo pack, let me know. If you don't know what it is, I will post it down below again, just to make sure that everybody knows. But um, it is October Breast Cancer Awareness Month. Um, Luckily, my products are so clean that we can um, offer them to can uh, you know people going through chemotherapy. Um, one is the mouth rinse. I didn't realize that people going through chemo get these horrible mouth sores. Ours doesn't have any of the um, what do I want to say alcohol, so it doesn't sting them. It actually helps them. We're putting in a bath bar which has uh, paraben free, and there's a bunch of other great stuff in it for them. Um, uh, aluminum free deodorant which is huge um, all of us women should be using an aluminum free deodorant we'll put that in there as well as the toothpaste so um, and I've already ordered the cute little bags to put them in and I'm super excited but we're gonna do this all month you guys so if day three we've already got six let's see how many we can do you guys drop me a drop me a number down there how many think we can do and then let's go after it. Um, please feel free to share this. I've got posts on my page. Feel free to share the posts about um, the cancer chemo packs. Lori, I know you shared it. Thank you so much. I believe Stephanie, you shared it. Thank you so much. Um, I just, I, I love giving back. I love, love, you guys know I love helping. And 
this is so near and dear to my heart that you know my father-in-law is a cancer survivor um, my grandmother died of breast cancer I mean I've got 75 Ed okay all right Ed put the number out there you guys you saw it 75 is what we're gonna go for all right Ed what's your number how many how many of you are you gonna do 75 um, I'll go for it I'll, I'll see how many we can get um, but anyway yeah it, it's near and dear to my heart I've I've always been a huge, um, anything I can do for breast cancer awareness, for, you know, telling everybody to get your mammograms. I started getting mine at 35. I harass all my friends. I harass my mom about getting mammograms. Um, it's just so, so important. If, you know, I, I do believe in prevention and if there's anything that we can do, um, you know, eating better or I, I know, you know, being in shape especially helps with the breast cancer. I believe from everything I've read growing up, unless it's changed, um, cause everything always changes, but I believe the heavier you are, the more estrogen you have, um, which then uh, puts you at a greater risk. I believe if, if anybody's, you know, a nutritionist or more um, more up to date than me, let me know if that's incorrect. But I've, you know, I've tried to watch my weight my whole life, kind of knowing that, you know, this is definitely in my background. Uh, my aunts have had it. Um, anyway, so oh, it's cold. Okay, my nose is running, and I'm gonna go inside. So. Thank you all for the, the comments about the hair. I am loving it. It's going to be fun. I'm going to try and see. It's a definitely a new way of curling it. So we'll see, you know, how I do, um, anyway, doing it anyway. But, okay, Ed put out the number. We're going for 75 chemo care packs. We're at six. So let me know what you can help with, please. Please, please. I will do all the ordering. I'll put them all together. All you have to do is get me money, uh, cash, check. I do Venmo, Apple Pay. PayPal what else is there um, I'll come get the money but anyway let's make this huge we're going for 75 by the end of October you guys have a fantastic Wednesday had to think about what it was and we'll talk to you soon